name. Tell me what um, what additional or yeah, authorization. Don't take me. I just want him so I can get the clothes and then clothes for the day. Ready? Mm -hmm. Okay, so we'll do a few um, basic pranayam. First uh, and foremost, you want to employ the bandhas. You know, before you can um, uh, control, uh, tame a wild river, you know, powerful river, or uh, control electricity, uh, you need to put in transformers, dams in place. Uh, so air is really powerful. So the bandhas are what we use to regulate the force of the air. So jalandar band, chin to chest. And gradually you feel that the back of the neck will stretch more and you can you will push harder and harder so don't worry in the beginning if it doesn't touch but chin to chest it also massages your thyroid then mula bandha visualize you're lifting your abdominal organs up right so rotate your hips upward and as if you're lifting everything upward going away from gravity what would you do if you were trying to take off just, just lift off what, what what action would you do i'm trying to lift myself up right. just mula bandha and then third one is when you do the uddiyan. So once you have mula bandha and jalandar bandha, so you maintain both of this, this pushing down, this lifting up, mula bandha lifting up. After the exhale, pull navel in and up. Release and then inhale. So you do these three bandhas, you maintain Mula Bandha and Jalandar Bandha at all the times. Uddiyan only after exhalation and you release before inhalation. Okay? So only in between full exhalation, Uddiyan, release and then inhale. Okay? In terms of the Pranayam, um, keep your fingers, uh, the ring and little finger on the left nostril, thumb on the right and the index and middle finger knuckles at the bridge of the nose. can use thumb and the last two fingers to close right and left. So let's just do one cycle of Anulom Vilom and then we'll do some Bastika and Kapalvati. So take a deep breath in and close right. Exhale to left. Inhale to left. Now close left, open right. Exhale to right. Inhale right, close right, open left, exhale left, and that's one cycle. That's basic Anulom Vidom, uh, that evens you out. Then Bastrika, there are multiple ways of doing Bastrika. Bastrika is forceful exhalation, forceful inhalation. This probably is the pranayam you want to be very, very careful with. Um, this is probably the most powerful force in pranayam. Uh, other than maybe holding your breath but holding your breath you will come out if you if you feel uncomfortable this you could easily overdo it so always be careful uh, the way i practice bastrika is multiple um, uh, positions and multiple uh, combinations of the nostril the first and foremost is uh, thumb on the right um, uh, joint of the nose ring and little finger on the left knuckles at the bridge of the nose and just exhalation inhalation and I do these in the breaks of 20 in the groups of 20 so I'll do 20 24 times so I'll do 20 then I inhale you always end your pranayam with inhalation otherwise you'll strain your heart does it make sense so you don't you don't do this don't stop after exhalation you don't have air do this and then you stop right so let me show you one um, module of Vastika just normal breathe in out in, start with inhalation and end with inhalation. Jalandra Bandha and Mula Bandha. Inhale and hold. What should move is your ribs, not shoulders. Your ribs move out and in, move out and in. So it's like the dhamni, right? Like the blacksmith's bellows. Okay, then other, com other uh, so I will do, I do four of these 20, 25 times each. Then I close left all together. I do bastika only with the right. So the same thing. Inhale.
inhale and stop. And you do the same on the left. Close right. The normal breath. And then you can switch. You inhale through one and exhale through other. So I'll just show four or five times. Inhaling left, exhaling right. Opposite. Inhaling right, exhaling left. Always stop at inhalation. There's Bastrika. In between pranayam, give some break, normal breathing, you can do brahmari, so close ears, eyes, mouth, nose, everything. To inhale, open your nose a little bit, take a deep breath in, the harder you press your ears, you will hear some sounds. To exhale, make own sound. Mm. Inhale and then close those again. is Brahmari. Once you feel that you normalize, relax, then you can do Kapal Bhati. Kapal Bhati is sort of half intensity of Bastrika. You're just focusing on exhalation, not necessarily forceful exhalation, just exhalation. Inhalations follow on its own. Again, always inhale and then stop. So I'll just show 15 or 20 um, exhalation. This I do fairly long, 5, 7, 10 minutes depending on talk. So again, Dhyalanda, Mula Bandha, breath in. Just focus on exhalation. This happens in the stomach. You can feel the vibration in your forehead the fingertips and thumb if you mildly press them you will feel your pulse blood blood pressure right there okay. a few deep breaths you can again do some brahmari with an anulom vilom um, five seven eight cycles um, and then in general pranayam uh, people may unintentionally over arch their back strain their back so a little bit of forward bend so a couple ways to do forward bend anytime you forward bend you exhale go forward stay there Holding breath outside, inhale, come up. Let's add a little bit more. This time we'll do two breaths. Palms interlocked at the back. You can use belt. Exhale, head down. Then inhale, arms up. As you lift your arms up, try and keep your elbows straight. With the belt, it will be possible. That lift your back up, which recovers the back strain. Exhale, arms down. Inhale, head up. So again, cycle. Exhale, head down. Inhale, arms up. Exhale, arms down. Inhale, head up. Again, hold as long as you can, of course. Uh, this is really good for um, concentration as well. Um, so after you've done all these, um, there is um, recovery. So if you sat in Padmasan or any uh, other pose, generally your legs are inward. So Keeping your legs rotated outward would help. Uh, here you can do um, the stomach in and up, the Udyan band. You can do the stomach abdomen churning. Uh, but one of the key things here to try is massaging the middle body organ. So, Mula Bandha and Jalandar band. Then exhale, pull stomach in.
after exhaling, you push the, put the fists in the stomach and just gently massage them. Uh, eventually, you will be able to see that you are able to go quite um, ways in. Right? Uh, so that was both fists. You can exhale. Inhale up. That was your right side. Inhale, exhale. Final um, recovery uh, session go do ikasan. Again, it's the lower back that you want to recover. So gently push it out. If you hold your ankles as if you're trying to lift your feet, toes up, you will lift your end up lifting your back upward, stretch it upward. So that will help you recover. Uh, other way to do the same is this, right? as if you're pushing your back backwards. An extended version that will take an hour and 30 minutes. <laughs> Thank you. So, so um, Ramdeji does not do Hastrika. Hastrika nahi karte hai. I think yeah. one of the reasons yeah. Auntie Ji Hastrika, I don't because think anybody should do Hastrika. Because I was either, totally either, wrong either, when I said mass, that this is Hastrika. If the mass, yeah, Hastrika is for very limited, uh, I mean, you, they say a lot of things you should be doing before you do Hastrika. I mean, very, very rigorous, stringent, disciplined lifestyle. Bastrika is, you know, it's life force. Okay, so it's car. So, you know, car ka engine, agar clean up karna hota hai, they say, you know, you should drive it to 55, 60, 70 miles an hour. Those guys out there drove 230 miles an hour. How many of us can do that? Oh, yeah, the racing. Yeah, he doesn't so do that. So that's Bastrika, right, exactly. So, so that's, you know, for really, yeah, because you know, I was telling you, he does it, but then I looked last night, like 2 o'clock, I yeah, was looking. Yeah. No, he's, he, he may have some it. videos, but uh, right, Bastrika, I don't, so Kapal Bhati, start with Kapal Bhati and Anulom mm -hmm. Bilom. I mean, you know, Kapal Bhati, you can do, for, he says, for 5, 10, 15 minutes. He said for uh, Anulom Bilom. Yeah. Yeah. I guarantee there will not be any disease yeah. come close to you. Yeah, yeah, Kapal Bhati is really, really powerful in terms of, because, you know, yesterday we talked, if you have a jar, and if you, if you want mm -hmm. to fill it with fresh material, fresh content, fresh food or whatever, you yeah. need to empty it and clean it. So what you're doing is you're just focusing on exhalation, exhalation, exhalation. So you're taking out all this stale air and then strengthening this middle body, the core that we talk about. And he said, gets up at, get up at 3.30 or 4 in the morning. <laughs> Early to bed. Mm -hmm. If you go to bed at 8 o'clock, no, 4 o'clock mm -hmm. is late hours. Mm -hmm. I'm trying, I'm trying. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you.